Hey there, it's Robert with BudBells.com and for today's warm-up you're going to work on uh, some breathing techniques where you lay on the floor, plug one side of your nose and breathe into your groin, lower belly and the bottom of your, of your ribs. Okay, then uh, work on some hollow rolling um, with uh, arms in a guard position and arms up over your head to where your palms are faced towards the ceiling and they're on, you know, one palm is on top of the other, okay, like you're diving into a swimming pool, okay? Um, and then three rounds of 46 seconds of plank and then 46 seconds of either headstand or handstand, depending on what kind of plank you do. Uh, it's Tom's 46th birthday, so we're going to do things in 46, okay? So the, the warm up is you lay on the floor and you can either do legs bent or legs straight. And you want to breathe into your belly and uh, groin area. Plug one side of your nose. So you get some good breath. So under load, you're, you'll be able to breathe into your stomach to get a good brace. Okay? Breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Then the hollow uh, rolling is in a guard position, squeeze your shoulders together, squeeze your elbows like you're gonna squeeze a block in between your elbows, sink your chest, tuck your chin, take your ribs, pull them down to your hips, squeeze your butt, lengthen your legs out, and this is your hollow, um, you know, hollowed out position. You're gonna roll from side to side. Keeping the plank together. Not letting your body separate and do this, okay? Then you can do the same thing with your arms above your head. Make sure you don't roll into your kettlebells. Shoulders together, elbows together, sink your chest. Abs, butt, breathe. Then, uh, planking in head or handstand. So if you plank on your um, elbows, you're gonna do a headstand, like this. If you plank on your hands, you're gonna do a handstand. And you can alternate rounds. There are gonna be three rounds of this. Okay, so I'm gonna do it against the pole. So if you plank forearms and toes, like this, 46 seconds. Then you go up into your headstand, See if I can hit this pole. <clears throat> See how good aim up I am. There it is. Headstand, 46 seconds. Come back down. Then you can do a plank on your hands, 46 seconds. And then a handstand. Ah, come on. <laughs> I'm scared. Ah. There it is. There you go. Handstand for 46 seconds. Whew. And then you do three rounds. So um, pick what, what kind of plank and um, inverted pose you want to do before the, before the rounds. Okay? The workout, two rounds. <clears throat> Starting out with double push press, double walking push press. So you're going to grab two bells. I'm going to walk, actually walk towards you. Double bells, and it's a push press. Take a step. Push press, take a step. Push press, take a step. Okay? 23 times. Then you're going to do V ups, they're called teaser V ups. V up, one arm up, the other arm up, both arms up. Roll down. That's one rep, 23 times. Right, left, both, roll down. All right, 23 times, 23 overhead swings. So when you do overhead swings, make sure you keep your stomach braced when you go up overhead and the arm stays straight. And um, it's just like you would do those hollow rolls. That's where we're doing those hollow, hollow rolls. So you get the idea and it carries over to the overhead swing, okay? Twenty-three times. 
Then you're going to do a deck squat to a burpee 23 times. Deck squat. Burpee. Stand back up. Do, do it again. All right? And then a high low plank um, with the bells. Set the bells far enough apart to where you can do a plank in, in between them. Here, hands, elbows, back to your hands, up to the bells. Alternating sides, all right, 23 times. Two rounds of that. And then the warm down, just to practice some pull-ups. Some hard style, uh, braced, heavy pull-ups, all right? There's your workout, enjoy it. See you next time.